22 kilos of plutonium mislaid. A startling amount, but that's just how much extra was discovered during the routine dismantlement of the Cadarache nuclear facility run by France's atomic operator, Arriva. They'd expected to find just 8 kilograms, but now it's feared the total amount of plutonium previously unaccounted for could reach three to five times that amount, up to 39 kilos. The plutonium we found was spread out inside the facility inside a number of objects we call glove boxes. So it wasn't in any way concentrated in the same place, and for that reason, there were a number of stages that allowed us to avoid an accident. France's nuclear watchdog says it's a level two incident on a scale of seven, but the lapse means safety margins were significantly reduced and could have led to a critical situation. In all, the site's operator found three times more plutonium than expected, an underestimate that raises concerns about the security of France's nuclear industry. Despite that lapse, Arriva site managers played down the gravity of the incident and defended their safety measures. Today, the security situation is under control. The inspectors visited us only recently, and everything's fine. There is no problem. The material is under control. It wasn't lost or used for other purposes. To make matters worse, the misjudgment was only revealed in October, but it was discovered in June. France's environment minister Jean-Louis Borloo denounced the almost four-month delay, calling for more transparency, while environmentalists have also seized upon the incident. Greenpeace France insists that that quantity of plutonium is enough to fuel five nuclear bombs. On the international level, plutonium is supposed to be dealt with to the nearest gram, and states are meant to follow international rules. It shows that Arriva is not capable of accounting for one of the world's most dangerous materials. The revelations come at a bad time, as domestic confidence in nuclear energy takes a bashing. Just this week, the national media revealed that treated French nuclear waste was being disposed of in Siberia. For now, all work on the site's dismantlement has been suspended until further notice. France's parliament has summoned the chief of the National Nuclear Waste Disposal Agency, demanding answers.